Hey everybody, it's Bubs. So a few days ago I bought some new bras and it really inspired me to make this bra fitting video because there's just a lot of girls who don't wear the correct bra size and a lot of girls who wear their bras incorrectly. So apparently 80% of girls don't wear the correct bra size. I used to hate wearing bras. I would come home and I'd take off my bra and I'd be like, oh my. And I know I'm not alone with this. A lot of girls feel the same way and I know that it's just a feeling of suffocation, you know? However, discomfort actually isn't the only bad thing. It could actually give you poor posture. It could cause denting in your shoulders and your sides. This one's a bad one, back fat. You know, wearing the wrong bra could actually make you like bulkier. You know, you can get like some um, of the tissue squeezing out and even to the top of your armpits. It could give you poor blood circulation and also poorly shaped boobies. I realized I hated wearing bras because I was just wearing the wrong type of bra and most importantly the wrong bra size. So today we're going to talk about how to correctly measure your bra size, how to correctly wear your bra and also share bras that will improve your body shape overall. Believe it or not, wearing the correct bra can actually make you appear slimmer, can actually make you leaner, um, it can make your arms appear thinner and most importantly give the glory your boobs are supposed to have, make them appear perkier and fuller. I told you this video is going to be life changing. Most women wear a cup size too small, but a bun size too large. Now first of all, let's do the bra size measurement and yes, you guys are going to find out my bra size. <laughs> you guys are going to laugh. First of all, I recommend you guys go to a good bra fitting specialist, someone who is experienced, not just a worker that you know works in a in the bra store. Uh, but obviously you can you can also do it yourself, that's absolutely fine. You'll need a tape measure, uh, a mirror so you can see what you're doing. And uh, I recommend you guys to wear a good fitting bra. Not bra that's like you know super potted plunging, just a good bra. Now there's a lot of ways to measure your bra size. A very common way people do it is you know they, they measure their bond size and then they add like you know five to six inches. That is incorrect. That is a way that was uh, developed in the 30s for bras that weren't as elastic. So, you know, don't do that method. It's actually now. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to measure our band size. So, uh, typically, you want to stand in front of a mirror, okay? So you can see what you're doing. When you're measuring. The tape should be parallel to the ground. It shouldn't be lower at the at the back and then higher at the top. It shouldn't be higher and then lower. And your band size is pretty much where your rib cage is, right underneath your boobs. You just want to breathe normally, and you want to hold the tape quite snug. So here, I believe I measure 26 and a half inches. So let's round it up to number 27. So if it's an odd number, you actually add one inch. If it's an even number, you just keep it the way it is. So 27 add one inch is 28. So next, we're going to measure our bust. Now the bust is the fullest part of your boobies. And that's, you know, pretty much just through your nip nips, your nipples. 31 inches, okay? So 31 minus 28, 29, 30, 31, okay, A, B, C. <laughs> so, yes, all my life I've been wearing bras in either 34A or 32B, but turns out I'm actually 28C. <laughs> Who's laughing and hard? The thing is, people don't realize that your cup size is actually relative to your band size. For example, a 36A cup could actually be bigger than a 32B cup. I just broke your world, didn't I? But in a good way, hopefully. Uh, but knowing your correct bra size actually gives you a better idea. Um, obviously, when you're in stores, certain brands, maybe their sizes go larger, some of their sizes go uh, smaller. So the best thing to do is just try in your band size and just try the different cups because you could be a C cup in one bra, a B cup in another bra. Okay, so now let's talk about how to correctly wear your bra. So that's another thing you should throw away worn out bras. I'm going to show you guys later the type of bra that's better for your body later. But okay, let's use this as a demonstration. So when you're wearing your bra, this is so awkward for some people. No point on me wearing true bras, so I'm just going to wear this over my face. Be like, okay, I'm back. You want to keep yourself kind of parallel to the ground, so just let all your boobies just fall forward into your cups. So, that was really awkward. Anyways, so when you're using the clasps, 
technically you should work from the artist one, okay? So if you have to use the inner clasp, then the bra size, um, the bra isn't correct for you, okay? Because your bra will eventually stretch and loosen through time, and that's when you start to work your way in. I'm gonna check to see if the front and the back is parallel. If it's too high, your straps are too tight. Make sure that the back isn't like all the way out there. So make sure it's only about two fingers or so. And then for the top straps, you know, you want to just have it like one finger. So it shouldn't uh, squish your skin. It shouldn't uh, feel uncomfortable. And most of the support should actually come from the band. It shouldn't actually come from your straps. And uh, what you can do is get your hands and you just want to Take it back, all the way to your back with as many fingers as you can and just massage it forward. You want to follow the cup, so don't just go like this, you know, like cleavage, cleavage, cleavage. Just kind of scoop it like this. Follow the contour of your, 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 your boobs. Remember when you're scooping your boobs, make sure you lean forward. And of course the boobs, not the boobs, sorry, the bra shouldn't be so tight that you're overspilling. When you wear a bra that's too tight, you actually force the deposits the tissue to go backwards and that's what gives you a bulky back and gives you you know like the like the fat, fatty tissue sticking out and chunkier looking arms so that's not good but it also shouldn't be too loose so that you have a gap between your cups that's not good either so we talked about how to find your correct breast size <laughs> i'm still laughing um how to wear your bra correctly so here's another important one wearing a bra that's actually good for you the first thing you'll notice about these bras are um the fact that they have super thick straps. See how thick it is compared to this one? And also the sides are mega wide. Not very cute, not very pretty, but actually these type of bras is actually what's going to help improve the appearance of your body. Um, you know, your sides, your back, your arms, and also most importantly, your boobs. So no matter what type of body shape you have, wearing these type of bras, thick straps and thick sides will benefit your body one way or another. Here I'm actually wearing the bra I showed you earlier underneath my shirt and even though it's comfortable it actually squeezes some of the fat above my armpits and it actually doesn't lift my boobs too well. The thin straps does strain me a little bit and sometimes your straps can actually give you neck pain and headache you know. So let's go put this on. You know you can see that it kind of lifts my, my boobs better. I, I think it gives me some cleavage just you know. <laughs> I look more lean here and that's because um, of the thick band here, so it really helps sculpt my body better, pushing everything to the front. But in terms of you know how it makes your boobs look and how it makes your body look, um, I feel like my body looks leaner. You can definitely see the difference that the other bra lifts my boobs better. The thick straps and the thicker sides makes the bra feel very comfortable, and I just feel you, you just know you're getting support. So I think especially with the bigger bust ladies definitely benefit from you know the thicker straps. So when you wear the correct bra, you'll not only have a better posture, it'll feel much more comfortable for you, it'll make your figure more streamlined and also push everything to the front where it's supposed to be and give you better shaped breasts. That's everything. Thank you guys again for watching. I love you guys. Talk to you soon. Mwah. Did anybody used to wear their mom's bras on her head and pretend they're Chun-Li from Street Fighter?